Hello and welcome to the Slingshot channel. As you know, I have several sponsors and one of my most important sponsors is Through Night. And actually, these guys are so generous, they sent me everything, everything I'm asking for. So I was asking them for a whole bunch of this great T01 flashlight. I love the T01 because it's so straightforward. It only has one mode and that is super bright, 120 lumen. Yeah, I mean, it's really, really bright. I'm not sure if you can see this good in the camera, but for a flashlight so small, it's actually amazing. And it's operated by a single AAA battery. That's it. Of course, you can also use rechargeables. Turn and it's on. Turn again and it's off. Of course, it also comes with a key ring and everything. And it's very inexpensive. In Germany, it only costs about 10 euros. That includes 19% uh, sales tax. And I think in the US you can get it for as cheap as $7 or something. That's great value for the money. But what can we do with a whole bunch of these? Well, let me show you what I came up with. Meet the flashlight top. <laughs> let me show you its features. It basically is just eight of these flashlights mounted to a little piece of wood with a screw as an axis. And um, of course it's attached with rubber and I only stabilized it with a little bit of duct tape. And now you can just turn them on one after the other. Like that. Until they are all nice and shiny. All right, now it's only illuminated by the rotating flashlight. Quite spooky, don't you think? <laughs> it's actually brighter in real life than it looks like a camera, I think. And if you start to turn it, I think it looks a little bit like a UFO <laughs> or a disco light. And you can also use this as a top, of course. It's that well balanced. Quite cool. But the real fun begins when you start attaching it to a drill, like this one here. <laughs> now the interesting thing is that when you start turning it looks a little bit like a strobe light but when you speed up the faster it turns the more it looks like a very very steady light as you see and this is now about 60 hertz and at 60 hertz the human eye doesn't see any strobe effect Now this is a bit scary because when you really turn them fast they spin really at high speed and of course they weigh as much as a 60mm steel ball. There is a AAA battery inside. So if they fly off that can be really dangerous. <laughs> I love it! <laughs> now of course my idea is to build this in big size. Like with a big 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 searchlight or maybe better a floodlight and use it outside to really illuminate everything around you. Some of the lights that through night cells will go as far as two miles and that could be an amazing torchlight, more like a rotating beacon. Maybe I should build it but it will be dangerous. <laughs> well, I hope you liked this because that's it for today. Thanks and bye bye. <laughs>